So Lambda Chi here is a new fraternity and there is a very large Greek life presence here in this campus. Um, it's been a campus that has historically had a lot of Greek life and a lot of influence from Greek students, which is great. To have Lambda Chi Alpha be again part of that, I think is really great for our fraternity. Um, I think that our role can be a nuanced one and it can be a new one for these students. I want students to look at Lambda Chi's as the leaders on campus who want to help all students and really help the community. That's really what I want for these men and I think they want that too. I'm, I'm really looking forward to starting something. Um, I think I've been given a really unique opportunity in being a founding president to leave a big legacy and, and really start something awesome for, for lots of men in the future here at the college. You know, we have fraternities that have been around for a long time. Um, William Kai being one of the fraternities that have been on campus the longest. Um, and they've got a great group of alumni that care a lot about the success of this chapter. And I think um, there's always men who um, see the stereotypes of fraternities and get turned off in the process. And I think Colonies um, and Lambda Chi have a really great opportunity to come in and showcase that fraternity isn't just about the party, it's truly about the brotherhood. And to sell that idea to students that may not initially see themselves in fraternities. Um, and I think that's such a unique part of the colonization process here on this campus because they meet a need um, that's not already being met. Um, and so I'm excited for the guys that they got and where they're going to take that and which other parts of campus they can reach um, through the, the eight guys that they have right now. I just want them to be really good leaders, um, be really involved, and, and that's kind of the demographic that we're exploring here. So I, I think they've got that already. Um, so just looking to add that Lambda Chi part to their life, um, see how they kind of mesh with that. I mean, it fits pretty well. Um, it's definitely one of those things where it teaches you it reinforces what you should have learned as a kid. Um, it kind of takes the, the life lessons that many people learned and went, okay, you learned them, but you forgot them because you're now your 19 college student, 19 year old college student. Let's reinforce that, make you actually a good person that people want to hang out with, not only in college, but actually over in society. Um, and I think that's really important is, is being able to not just be that stereotypical fraternity kid, but actually be a gentleman and a scholar. I think that fraternities and sororities bring a unique sense of community to, to the campus. Um, the bonds of fellowship that they have uh, within their chapters is incredibly strong and I think provides a really good model to our other students of you know, how they can engage with each other and support each other and bond over shared interests um, and, and then go out using those shared interests and shared values to improve their community. I really do think that at the end of the day, Greek life is heavily influenced by recruitment and it's heavily influenced by culture and perception. Um, perception is everything, how we perceive our new members, how they perceive us, how our founding fathers perceive their uh, position on campus um, in the greater Greek community. And I think that we have a lot of work to do in Greek life across the country and this campus is no different. And I hope that Lambda Chi Alpha can be the leaders to instill the difference going forward. Um, and to be the people who aren't afraid to stand up to, for what's right and for the values that they were recruited for in the first place. And as founding fathers, I want them to be able to instill that in the colony going forward. And then also to just be able to find that voice. I think that a lot of students see Greek life as one thing and we are really desperately trying for it to be the other thing that we know and love. And I think that these men are very well established to be able to do just that. And I hope they do. I hope they continue to find men that want to just push for their correct culture um, and just be great men and great leaders.